two minute rounds, just like a boxing match. All right, guys, so we've done all of the long form videos. Now Mahi and I are gonna debate in short form. So we're gonna have a little bit of fun, get a little bit ridiculous, and we're gonna draw from a hat, pick a neighborhood, and then Mahi and I are gonna argue it out and see whose neighborhood is the best. If any of these neighborhoods we're talking about stand out to you, let us know in the comments. Also check out our other videos where we go into detail on each of these places. You gotta represent your hood. Okay. Why it's better, why you should live there. Okay. Yeah, what'd you get? Mililani. Okay. Mililani versus West Oahu. Your place sucks because it rains all the time. Your place sucks because it's super hot all the time. No. Yes, it is. No, because there's the rains. ocean right there. Just it keeping barely us, rains. The ocean breeze is just right there. No, it's very hot there. It's probably the hottest side of the island. No, Eva is the hottest part of the island because the Eva Plain heats up. We you have get the no ocean rain. Breeze. You are, none of your plants grow. Your grass is all dead. <laughs> yeah. for me greenery is not the most important thing in the world so i don't care is brownery the most important thing i can <laughs> water my grass myself okay. oh you're gonna have to pay for that though you're gonna have a higher water bill because you if you care about your lawn west oahu you're gonna pay for more water than you will in Milwaukee. it's okay i'm saving so much money on the cost of my house true where do you work that, um, because you're the furthest away from most jobs well i, I work at Coalino. you know i'm good you don't <laughs> Let's just say you don't work. So rephrase that question. Because your job is not in on Waianae, you're the furthest commute you will have on this island to get into town. Yeah, but it doesn't matter because when I come home every evening, I catch the most beautiful sunset and my neighbors and I cruise, mm -hmm. have a beer. I love that for communal. you. Yeah. But you have a flight to catch tomorrow and there's an accident on Farrington Highway. I think you need to stop telling me what I am and, and aren't. <laughs> In Mililani, you have alternate routes. Say there's an accident on Cam Highway, you can get on the freeway. How many times a year does that happen? Very rarely because yeah. you can, that's that's great. How does it feel to have your association tell, tell you how to live your life? It's okay because once it's because 10 o'clock, my, my we, we neighbors can't thing. be pumping their music and I just go to sleep peacefully. And the trees, when the wind blows them down, somebody comes and cuts how do, it up. How does it feel that like, there's 13 different colors that all every home can be painted and that's it. I'm okay with that. Yeah. It yeah. seems like with all the your tattoos and you're kind of an individual, but I guess not with your home because no, they tell you I'm what not, to do. Yeah. I'm not an individual when yeah. it comes to, I don't want a purple house. I want tattoos all over my body and a nice agreeable gray home. <laughs> you don't have access how it, how to like it? multiple different grocery stores or us. Yeah. Oh, we have couple of, We just stop on the way home. Everything's there. Making a decision to go get a gallon of milk in couple of is a lot different than me. I'm like five Tomorrow, minutes away sack from. And save, set. Expensive. Cheaper than gas. Gas is expensive out there too. How come? We hard for our gas. Oh yeah, we hard for our gas. That's why hard. You never seen that? <laughs> no. I know you must not be a beach person because mm. you couldn't be further from the ocean. What well, you guys do? Play baseball. Yeah. Yeah. I can, well, that's another thing. I can go outside and play baseball. As or, long as it's not raining. Yeah, but you're raining. not going to die of heat exhaustion. As long as it isn't could, raining and the association isn't like working on the park or something, I guess you There's like could 20 play other baseball. parks that I can go to if the association just so happens to be working on that one park I wanted to go to. You would need a lot of parks when you have no ocean. That's fine. It's 20 minutes with no traffic to the North Shore. So. Uh, not not, yes, it not is. door to water. Door to water? Yeah. Not park install to water. No. 20 minutes. West Oahu <laughs> takes that one. <laughs> West Oahu. I can see it. Yeah. We okay. Hawaii Kai. Maui. You can't even represent. You don't know how to do that one. My place is better than your place because mm. we have Haleakala, a beautiful mountain mm -mm. that in the West Maui Mountains and there's this valley and you just always feel like the energy. Oahu, like Hawaii Kai don't have that kind of energy. Okay. Uh, my place is better because I don't know. I truly believe Maui is better. So. <laughs> That's not the point. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm just like, hmm, mm. my place is better because you have way more thing, way more amenities close to each other. You don't have to drive far to do anything. If you want Costco, it's right there. If you want a yeah, cool coffee shop, Kahului. it's right there. No, you don't. Yep, I live Kahului, Maui, so I got all that. Yeah, but your beach far away then. My beach is close and my Costco is close. What beach? Hawaii Kai. Yeah, that's a beach. What gravel. And what? No, but nothing in Kahului. The harbor? Ew. It, it barrels. No, no, that's no. That's just a left, so. <laughs> I, was, I use my friend Matt's video. It barrel. Kahului Harbor barrels. You have. And Kihei is not that far, or like. Kihei is pretty far. No. 
Yeah, it is. It's not 15 minutes. It's not Sandy's is right around the corner if you want to get barreled. That's true. But most people can't even swim Sandy's. Hawaii Kai is close to dangerous oceans, so most so, people can't even get in the water. Kahului is leptospirosis in the harbor water. You want to get staff? We'll go ple- Kihei, though. Still, you like it, staff, go Kihei. Cove had number one most uh, human feces tested in that water a couple years ago when I went. So kind of dirty over there. Hawaii Kai's water is probably cleaner. You're a hater. I'm not. I love Maui. Okay. This is hard for me. Hawaii Kai has a nice restaurant. Maui has a strong food truck game. True. Uh, and, Hawaii Kai and, has Leonard's. Okay. Maui has Ululani's. So why can you get Ululani's? That's, that's very not Hawaii Kai. That's close enough. That's If we're talking about Maui, can we can just ha- drive. We have Ululani shave ice in Maui, and we have coffee ice cubes in the coffee. Oh, my God. I'll make you coffee ice cubes. Pro tip. Turn your coffee into ice cubes, and you can do that in Hawaii Kai also <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> at your house, which is beautiful. Yeah, but so the junk thing about Hawaii Kai is just one road, Kalani on Ole Highway. So accident. You just, just That's the same to be said of like pretty much anywhere you go on Maui, though. Just one road, you get accident. As I was saying it, I realized I was setting a trap yeah, for myself. So. You know what's good about Hawaii Kai? That's junk about Maui. What? It's pretty residential. It's pretty much people who live there in there. So you're not really worried about, you know, too much tourism in your area. The junk thing about Hawaii Kai is your guys' zippies, no more bathroom. Let's talk about Hawaii Kai zippies for a second. Regardless, of, <laughs> there's bathroom very close by. You will just walk. Our zippies has a view of the marina. Yeah, it's you ha- eat beautiful. Water, you can eat a waterfront zip pack. Yeah, yeah. The you can have like a, a $1,000 dining view yep. for a $12 bento. Yep. Okay. All right. We'll so, do another one. Who won? Who won? I, I, I think or Hawaii Kai won. Where, of the two, where would you? Where would you? Where would I live? Yeah. Maui or Hawaii Kai? Yeah. Let's make it not money is no issue, but like you can definitely afford to be either place. And my job is there? Yeah. I get bored on Maui. You think like so? You eventually moved home. I did. And you had a strong friend network and everything there. Mm-hmm. Hawaii Kai, they're just, Hawaii Kai is, it's secluded enough. You can just jump up to like the Sandies, Makapu'u, up Kaniyanole Highway. Mm-hmm. But Maui is very broad too. You're talking about up country. Yeah, you're right. About it's Kihei, like all Maui. Yeah. But still, I'd probably go Hawaii Kai because I, I want to be next to all the Oahu things. And if I really need to get to like seclusion, I can just fly to Kona, Big Island, Waimea. Yeah. Whatever. Of these two, Oahu, there's definitely a reason I moved home to Oahu, but I don't know that I'd like choose to live in Hawaii Kai. It's not like my, for like the lifestyle that I like, it's not really for me. So if these were my two options, Maui. Like if I change it, Kahului or mm-hmm. Hawaii Kai? Then it would Hana be Hawaii Kai. Or Hawaii Kai. It would be Hawaii Kai. Kihei Over. or Hawaii Kai. Yep. Lahaina or Hawaii, like it varies, right? Yeah. Oh, look Honolulu. what I got. Honolulu. Oh, no. <laughs> I got Mahi's home. I want that one. This is, this is going to be hard for you. Okay. So how are you liking that traffic? Oh, I, I work in town, so it's really easy for me. It works well. Yeah. yeah. I actually just walk. What you live in? Shoebox. No, I live in um, Ward Village, actually. Oh. Yeah. Wow. So what? Like million, two million? No, it was like 800 in the 800s for brand new construction oh, in Koula. No, second row. I still have a view of the ocean. Oh, yeah? Yeah, I oh, do. you got in early, yeah? Yeah, I did. <laughs> <laughs> well, I got in early, and I live up Pupukea. How early? <laughs> <laughs> you know, I have the best surf in the world. I have yes. a bunch of healthy people who, you know, do yoga and, and <laughs> eat organic food. This, that feels like you're saying that facetiously. No, it's, it's amazing. I, I'm down with it. Okay. Yeah. You kind of smell my patchouli deodorant. It's oh amazing. Oh, my God. I can walk to anything I need to get to. You'd want to with that traffic. You'd want to walk. Yeah. I mean, yeah. also, if I want to be healthy, I can walk. And... I can walk. I was walking along though? the sand. Anywhere. You live Pupukea. Where are you walking? Well, well, Foodland. My, my other house is... You got to walk two miles back uphill after. What well, you going by? Better be light. House, my other house is Wailua. Better... Oh, your other house? Yeah, yeah. We have second houses. Yeah. Okay. My other house is um, Diamond Head. I would have said Manoa. That's not... Manoa is its own thing. Its own thing. Yeah. Nuuanu. Nuuanu is its own thing too. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Uh, oh, when you come over the over the pineapple fields to my place, you yeah. just like... <sighs> yeah. You see pine trees, True. ocean. Unless it's like... Really, we have the best acai bowls. 
<laughs> we have uh, a Napa. Uh, <laughs> we have a Napa. We have a city mill. We have a spaghetti place. What's it called? Food truck game. Spaghettini? Yes, it is. Yeah. We have food truck game is world class. Mm-hmm. And it's just a place to relax. It's How stressful. relaxing is it during the go. winter time when it takes you an hour to get to the grocery store because everybody is trying to go watch the surf on the seven mile stretch of beach there with all the contests running? Well, that's that rarely happens. That happens for months every year. Oh, so you frequent our area. I hardly go your area. No, I moved away because it was too humbug. <laughs> <laughs> now I live on a little. <laughs> <laughs> I hardly go to your area unless I got to go doctor or something. To Honolulu? Yeah. Okay, but even if you just got to go like to Haleiwa from Pupukea or to Haleiwa from I Wailua. Bike. I just ride bike. It's like a couple miles. What if you need to go get toilet paper or something? You're going to carry that under your arm? But you got to... How big, how big is your really basket light. on your bike? Toilet cause... paper is light. <laughs> what about... Well, you, you have kids, right? You have two boys? Yeah. How's the school? You You guys like that? Oh, we cannot talk about that. School's great. <laughs> we love it. My kids we go to, love it. <laughs> my kids go to school with uh Kelly Slater's kids, John John's kids. John John has kids at that school. <laughs> yeah. Mm, okay. No guarantee those guys' kids homeschool <laughs> so they can surf all day, but I'm <laughs> just saying. We have vegan, we have like the beatbox cafe. We literally have any kind of anything you could ever yeah, imagine when really it comes to like food, food I, stuff. Yeah, I can't. I we can't. have Whole Foods. We don't. We have like what Whole Foods is trying to be. We what have is that? real granola stores. Stores. Yeah, shops. Which one? Uh, well, the one where Beatbox Cafe. <laughs> That's just one. What was that called? I forget already. Beatbox celestial. Something. Celestial Natural yeah. Foods. Yeah, Celestial yeah. Natural Natural Foods. Yeah. Uh, we have a yoga co-op. I'm sure I do too. I, don't I got core power you have a yoga. yoga membership. Core power yoga. Yeah, membership. We have a yoga core. I prefer a membership. Yeah. But, you know, price for what you can buy in your area, real estate wise, mm-hmm. in my area, you get a house for your condo. True. But I can get like a luxury condo that was just built as opposed to a, a house that's 40, 50 years old that's going to need lots of improvements over yeah. the years. How, so. how are the steel beams and lawsuits and stuff going? On Fine building? in my building. Oh, your building's okay? Yeah. Oh, how convenient. Yeah. Well, do your due diligence. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay. So which one would you rather live? Oh, my God. I Well, see, that's the thing. I want both. Yeah. Like in the dream, in like my fantasy land. Award condo. Yeah. And a North Shore house. I want a ward condo. I literally that. I yeah. want to both of these. Yeah. I want to walk down to Istanbul. Yep. Get me some Turkish saute and mm-hmm. rice pilaf. Yep. And then go back to North Shore and get me an acai bowl. And be left alone and just like not deal with humans. Like yeah. I want both. I want yeah, the synergy yeah. of town and I want like the North Shore country. So it's everything. Yeah. Okay. Let's see. <laughs> Kane Ohe. Kahala. Oh, interesting. You don't really get like, oh, I might move Kane Ohe, but I also might move Kahala. <laughs> it must, uh, you talk about rain. Mm. Woo! You guys get pressure washer to press the, pressure wash the mildew <laughs> off of your house, your driveway. Yeah. Your but, car, your clothes. But you know what? At least I don't have to shoot off my cars like every other day if I'm close to the ocean in Kahala. So not too oh, bad. No. So we're not, we're good. We buy Whole Foods. Well then, I'm closer to the bay than uh, in Kaneohe, my house. I'm not. I'm not what all the way up in Akuyamano. What you gonna do in that bay? Kayak. Oh yeah, right. Or stand up paddle like that guy in the Kaneohe video. Oh, as if we don't have ocean everywhere to kayak in. Not really a lot of access points for your ocean. Got. Where's people parking? Beach park. Where? Right, right before you go into um, Kahala Hotel and uh, Wildlife Country Club. Mm. We have a country club, we have Kahala Hotel, we have Whole Foods, we have some of the most elevated and luxury real estate mm-hmm. in all of Hawaii. Mm-hmm. Uh, we're right close to town, so if you do, you know, you're, you happen to still be working, I hate that for you, but <laughs> we, you could go, if you come stay in my house, you mm-hmm. could get to work easy. We're a more inclusive neighborhood where you can be anywhere from a first-time home buyer all the way up to a luxury homeowner as well. 
uh, more opportunity for everybody in any stage of their wealth building to have opportunity to purchase and live in and enjoy this community, which has everything well, you could okay. want. Except for ocean that you want to spend any time in. Not the best usable in. ocean, but we have a Target coming up. They're building a Target, and Windward Mall is actually quite nice these days. I don't know when the last time you've been was. I've been to Windward Mall. It's pretty nice. It's better than Kahala Mall. Yeah, know? it's really nice yeah. if you want to have like I everything. Don't know, have like dinner with someone like who at a food court yeah. i do want to have dinner with someone at a food court yeah <laughs> we have uh hoku's fine dining we have Pumeria <laughs> grill yes yeah, so you wouldn't know no i don't you know you, why. Wouldn't, you wouldn't you wouldn't know i'm more we, relatable to from everyone else you wouldn't know. <laughs> we are oh we're right by uh all the private schools yeah we have nice open areas with large parcels of land in a lot of areas a lot more oh, country you mean, like, where all the chickens are waking you up yeah where crowing? you can actually raise chickens and have yeah. your own sort of little homestead if that's what you want then yeah you couldn't do yeah, that in kahala you couldn't be oh no we get we, get, we have pasture raised eggs at whole foods that's right i don't need do. chickens waking me up <laughs> That's pretty much it. Okay. Where would you live out of Kaneohe or Kahala? Wait, are the results in yet? Did I, did I win? No, I would live Kaneohe. For, like, uh, <laughs> depends. But more than likely Kaneohe. But it yeah. would just, it annoys me how much Mililani rains and isn't near the ocean. Yeah. But Kaneohe, you could shoot up to like Kaava and stuff pretty quick. And over the H3, you're in like Aea and stuff. Mm -hmm. Probably just as quick as from Mililani. Depending where in Kaneohe you are. Yeah. So probably for me, Kaneohe. Yeah. Even the like luxury real estate in Kaneohe, like Lipuna, mm -hmm. is pretty cool. Pretty gorgeous in a different way. So Kahala offers like these expansive ocean views. Mm -hmm. But because of the bay and the changes of color and, and, and blue and green and then mountains and the backdrop and Ko'olaos, the luxury real estate in Kaneohe is, I don't know, maybe arguably better. Salt Lake Moana. Oh, that's, that's the same, same. That's like same, same. Yeah, you you yeah. pick a new one, yeah. yeah. Waikiki. Okay. Oh. Interesting. Oh, good luck. Okay. May the odds be ever in your favor. Okay, so how do you like that crime, the prostitution, the, you know, noise, the mm -hmm. rats, the roaches, gazillions of tourists, mm -hmm. the hon honking horns, Aww. the... <laughs> the no parking, maybe even the unit you you own has no parking. Mm -hmm. uh, how do you like those things for you? I love them. How do you? <laughs> I love all of those things for me. Yeah. How do you like that Safeway? Because that's pretty much all you got. Huh? I said, how do you like that Safeway? Because that's pretty much all you got in your area. We have the Navy Exchange. Oh, because everybody has access to the Navy Exchange. Everyone has access to the food and the vendors. Yes, let's go to the Navy Exchange for food. You never have. No. I mean, I've been to the Navy Exchange. It's not like, hey, I want to go out and eat. I'm going to go oh, to the no, Navy we Exchange. Also, you also have that food court area right by the Navy Exchange. The where Great. Ruby Tuesdays. I love Koa Pancake House. Wow. Yeah. All of that stuff. I know exactly where you're talking about. But yeah. I have everything you could ever imagine for like down like a little you, bit as mcdonald's all the way up to like five-star dining anywhere at any of the resorts on the waikiki strip on kalakawa all of it yeah i guess if you make it there without you know any oh my god getting mugged or something Stop it exaggerating. Would, it would be good to eat those places what's it like being so far away from the ocean i'm so sorry that you no no. Far away from the ocean? Yes, you are. 10 minutes. I'm surfing bowls. Kewagos. That's not 10 minutes. 12, maybe. Oh, my God. Map it right now. One minute. I'm surfing anywhere in Waikiki. What? You you longboard? I know your board not fitting in the elevator. Good thing I'm not living on any of those buildings. I just get one rack outside like oh, most of you the buildings do. do. Wow, how convenient. We all have racks. Yes, oh, because yeah. Too everybody bad your surfs there. your board is there. stolen. No, it's not. They're secure. Your board is stolen. They have a lock on them. My board is safe and secure. Your board is stolen. No, it's not. Dinged. No. Dinged and stolen. No, it's locked away in a rack, and I just pick it up, go downstairs when I'm ready. Yeah. Don't even need uh, clothes. I don't need a bag. I just put my, what you call, put my bikini on, grab my board, and walk to the ocean right there. Yeah, and, and sit with 100 people. 
trying to catch one wave. If I'm there at 5.30 in the morning, I am not sitting with 100 people. 50. I'm, I'm catching. Okay, first of all, that's a long stretch of beach, and you are grossly exaggerating. 50? No. Well, the, he, I get to surf the waves and, that and Duke often got waves. surfed. Plenty right now. Right now, but how often? Every half a year. <laughs> every time that get get waves get <laughs> whenever get waves get we we if you gotta if you want to go to the airport we're right there yeah i i live in hawaii where am i going that's because you get traffic right now. look what how many minutes did it say 23 minutes 20 10 minutes 12 minutes there's no traffic right now what no it's it? red and stuff <laughs> 5 a.m. 5 a.m.? You said you were surfing at 5 a.m.? Yeah. If we got to go catch no crowds. What does 18, 18 to minutes. 24 minutes. 18 minutes. Oh that includes God. watching your board. No, it does not. <laughs> <laughs> so, if, you have, if we want to go airport, bingo, bango, right next to the airport. Yeah, well, I live in Waikiki. Where am I going to go? I love it. I don't want to take no plane anywhere else. Yes, other than, you like, do. I live where you, I live where you vacation. You I live to... where you guys vacation, man. No, like... that's why everyone goes Maui, Big Island, Kauai, because no, they don't want to go Waikiki. No, 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 no. Look, I moved to Waikiki because I love Waikiki. I love Diamond Head. I love Leahi. I love it. I love homelessness. I love crime. <laughs> I love crime. I love street. Oh, you're a regular and... Ninja Turtle. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> I am a Ninja Turtle, and I love all we of those things. We <laughs> have Monolo Valley, uh -huh. which is underrated. Mm -hmm. We have uh, for military bases. We're right by almost all of them. Yeah. We have enough shopping centers to get us by. We don't want too many. Shopping <laughs> pointless. Just shopping. <laughs> If I want to go Aiea, Pearl mm -hmm. Ridge, I mean, right there. Mm -hmm. The stadium, stadium swap meet. If I want to go to 50th State Fair, Winter Wonderland Lights, this is all right there. That's and just like one time a year those things happen. My son is an ice skater. So, oh, yeah? Yeah, he plays hockey. Oh, he, oh, is he an ice skater or does he play hockey? Hockey both. You have to ice skate <laughs> to play hockey. <laughs> <laughs> you have to ice skate to play hockey. Oh, okay. Yeah, so okay. Ice Palace is here. Yeah, Ice Palace is there. I yeah. will give it up to Salt Lake for Ice Palace. And, and, and Soon's Korean Barbecue. Okay, Korean Barbecue, Waikiki got all of, the, all of no. them. Sick Dorok, is that what it's called? Sick Dorok. It is, I promise. Is that Waikiki? You know what she's talking about? Or is that Keomoku? I can't ride yeah, my bike. Yeah, that's Keomoku. Is it? Yeah, all those Korean places yeah, are yeah, Keomoku. Yeah, anyway, they're right over there. That's super close. <laughs> I can ride my bike to anywhere. I can, you know, go out and, like, actually enjoy nightlife. You, gotta ride, you know why you got to ride your bike? Why? Because all the parking tickets kind of drive already because you no. got so many parking tickets. And then the streets are one way. So you just ride your bike. I ride my bike because it's convenient. And I live there because it's convenient. Because it's convenient I want to ride your bike when you have no car from parking tickets. First of all, be more responsible with your parking. Second of all, <laughs> some of these buildings do have parking stalls. And if that's something that you don't need anyway because you prefer to ride your bike or you prefer walkability, this is it. Salt Lake, you cannot walk nowhere. We have sidewalks everywhere. Great. Where are you going? Where's the destination? The walkability here, I can go to work. I can go to eat something. I can go to the gym. I can go to the beach. I can go have coffee. What gym are you going? Any of those gyms over there. There's the gym right on top of the... The kind that looks over the beach right there by the hotel. What's it called? Is that a 24? In Waikiki? Yeah. You're talking about the Hulu? hotel gym in, in a hotel? Maybe. I bet you could sign up for that. <laughs> 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 Probably. I mean, why Wait, not? Oh, you live in a hotel now? Yep. Maybe I do. Oh, interesting. Maybe I live in a condo hotel. Okay. Interesting. Maybe. Yeah. How do you feel about wanna... um, even though you keep Because I know you're a clean person. Uh-huh. But you get cockroaches because, you know. I just call the pest walls. company and do what I'm supposed to do. The pest company kind of keep all your surrounding I'm neighbors. sorry. Do you think that Salt Lake is immune to cockroaches? But at least I have a single family house. No, you don't. You live in a condo. <laughs> <laughs> you live in a condo. We do have a lot of condos. We do. You do. Yeah. Yeah. What elementary are your kids going? I don't know. Waikiki. Actually, Waikiki. Isn't that a good, a like, a lot of people want their kids to go to that yeah, school. Yeah, that's true. Okay, which one would you live? Waikiki or Monolo? Or Salt Lake? Salt Lake. Salt Lake. Okay, Waikiki or Salt Lake? Salt Lake, I think. Still, yeah. Yeah. Um, 
Actually, you know what? I don't know. Depends when kids or not. It, yeah. If I have no kids, I might. Yeah, I could like spend some time in Waikiki. Waikiki. Like Gold Coast or whatever. It's like that oh, area by Tom's different. side. Like that's, that's a different. Yeah, yeah, like I could do that. As always, guys, visit our website, coreteamhawaii.com. Reach out, fill out the contact form, and I'll see you guys soon. HawaiiHomeValue.com for sellers or you know what just for refinancers for homeowners oh, you want to sell in a year from now it's better to understand your home's value today my friend lived there sold her house during the pandemic got her a house down the street off market so that auntie 95 years old could live in the home on the first floor the good news is we're able to reposition into something that she got for probably a hundred thousand dollars under value my HawaiiHomeValue.com my name is Derek Okahashi my team is called Core Team Hawaii. I'm just obsessed with this stuff. I love real estate. Uh, I love talking about it. I love helping. So please, please hit us up. On versus off base. Okay, let's just do this together. Okay. On versus off base. <clears throat> off base. Oh, damn. <laughs> <laughs>